For today's little adventure, I'm going to take this blank canvas and I'm going to create a chicken themed Christmas painting. The first thing I do when I start painting is I draw what I want to paint first. And then a portrait is just a painting. Okay, so I drew my design, which is a Santa Claus riding a rooster. I do like chickens. Anyway, so I what I do first is I look at the colors I want to pick, so that way I'm kind of have those planned out already. And then I just kind of start painting the background first, and then I'll paint, you know, little things, sometimes bigger things. So I'll end up painting the bird before I paint the details on his face. I'll paint the background and then I'll do the tree and I'll do the details of the tree later, stuff like that. So you'll see the difference, it's like the different things I go through. But the first thing I do is I'm gonna pick my colors. So we've got permanent red, and then we've got a scarlet. So for my Santa outfit, I think I'm gonna do more of the permanent red. So that's gonna be a color that I use. I'm just gonna put it aside. Obviously I'm gonna use white. I need to probably get some more white. All right. So greens, there's lots of greens here. And I like to mix my greens together, to be honest. So I will go through and I'll pick my greens out. <laughs> and then I'll just kind of randomly put them together and see what colors go well together. So since it's more winter time, we're not gonna have, we're not gonna really do a lot of bright green. Because one thing I like to do during the summertime, or really I like I like to mix my neon colors together with other colors to make things pop out. However, since this is winter, it's not gonna be bright green. So I'm gonna take this one out of my group, along with this one. And I don't need my teals, even though those are really pretty colors. Take those out. <clears throat> so not that one. So I'm thinking my grass might be this green and then I might mix it with another color. So maybe the grass green and the chrome oxide green I might mix together and see what they look like. So that's the category there. And then the green of my tree. Hmm, I think I'm gonna use this dark green here. Like I want something different than the green of the grass. I think I'm gonna use this green for my tree. And then we're gonna use a darker brown, this burnt umber for feathers. Okay, so roosters can either be simple colors, but it's Christmas time, so let's make a cool decorative, not decorative, <laughs> a cool colored rooster. So that one, I'm gonna probably go online and look at some different colored roosters, but like there are so many shades of feathers on chickens. You can have actual blue feathers, you have red, you have gold, you have yellow, you have black, you have brown, like really any color you can think of, a rooster would have could have that color. So I could even probably have this turquoise green as a feather color. So I need to think about that. So I will go online before I do the feathers of the rooster. So the rooster will probably be the last thing I paint because that's one of the that's one of the ones where he's gonna be probably more, more colorful than the rest of them. So I'm going to put some paint on my little, whatever you wanna call this, my palette. I don't know what that is. <laughs> it's a plate. <laughs> As you can tell, I've painted on it and I'm not very good at cleaning things off. So there's chunks of acrylic paint on there. It doesn't hurt anything, it's just there. And then I have all these brushes. Like I said, I'm not taught. I don't know how to paint uh, professionally, but I just pick a brush that I like. And like, you know, this one I will use to put on my grass and my sky. And that's gonna be about it. And I might actually use some of these. I haven't used them yet. Use these for the feathers. So we kind of get some designs on the feathers because feathers are just so nifty. And I might use some on the trees too to get some design on the trees.
So I finished my painting. I have my barn, I have my rooster, I have my Santa riding rooster, I have my tree with some gifts. Um, I have a very colorful rooster. It's, I realized that I should have used lighter colors for the sky and the grass to make his tail stand out more, but it's still pretty cool. So thank you for joining us for today's little adventure of seeing how I paint.